Welcome back everyone for a wrapping wrap up. Cobra Kai season six watch party. It's been an eventful week in Cobra Kai as many actors are posting on Instagram that they're finishing up. They even had the wrap party Friday night, the end of an era. It's sad. Is this really the end? Are we wrapping it up after all this time? Well, yes. But then again, all good things must come to an end. And so must this. Every show and every story, no matter how great, must come to a proper conclusion and end. A story that never ends really isn't much of a story at all. And maybe that's a big problem in Hollywood these days, but that's another video. So yes, production is wrapping up, but it is still sooner than we expected. As you recall, last year when production initially shut down, we saw this post from Curtis who said they were shutting down seven months early. Seven months! Plus, at the beginning of this year, Sholo and Jacob talked about spending the next six months in production in Atlanta. So, as you recall, when I broke the news about season six having 15 episodes a year ago, I speculated that the last five episodes could be extra long. Like those five episodes could have a total runtime of what would have been a normal season. It made sense as the shooting schedule, as we were aware of at the time, appeared to be twice as long as a normal season. Well, now that they're wrapping up in much less time than that, it's reasonable to assume that no, part three of season five will be mostly the same length as normal. While I do suspect the final episode will be extra long, it is most likely that the other episodes will still run about 30 to 35 minutes. Alternatively, this could be a situation where the biggest climax is actually in the second to last episode and that one runs extra long. In that case, the final episode would be more of a normal length. It depends on the style and pacing of the show. Game of Thrones was often like that. The climax is the penultimate episode and the final episode is the denouement. However, I will note that has never been the style of John, Josh and Hayden. They like to end hard on their climax. In every previous season, the end or even the last shot was a short tease at what was coming next. Season one teased Crease. Season two, Allie and her friend request. Season three had Crease calling Silver and the team up. Season four had Terry Silver taking over and Miguel in Mexico. Season five, of course, had Kreese escaping prison into the unknown. Obviously, there will be no tease at the end of season six. There's nothing left to come. Some suspect the show will have some tease or tie in with the movie, but that is misguided. They aren't obligated to tie into the movie in any way. The movie is not even part of the same universe. It's just a fake parallel universe with some of the same characters. So that means the very end will be a wrap up. Something special, probably with our two main stars. We don't know what it is and there will be plenty of time to speculate later, but that's how it ends. The important point is that a shorter shooting schedule implies a more normal runtime for each episode. It's still the longest season ever and there will be more ass kickery than ever before. That is something to look forward to. And speaking of ass kicking, you aren't gonna wanna miss the final part.